combined with the credit seeds are going to be the minority. So regardless of the turnout of the vote. Governor, Peter Semler. Remember I interviewed you with this in Kirkuk yes. when I was there? Yes. Um, we wrote that you're... I'm, I'm playing a little late. I, I can walk with you. Congressman, yeah. Yeah, because we wrote about you as the model for the rest of Iraq, a strong governor who runs his country and his, his region. Yeah, as a, you. And what do you think now? I mean, do you think this can be transferred to Mosul and other places where you have strong governors and mayors who can just do the basic business of government? It's uh, clearly things are, uh, uh, the government of Mosul, you know, his situation is uncertain. They're calling for his removal. The governor of Basra is, is being removed. Yeah. Uh, governor of uh, Salah Adin is in prison. Yeah. Uh, governor of Anbar has been, uh, has been actually uh, also uh, uh, dismissed by the governing council. Yeah. So it's a chaos. I, I, I don't know what to tell you. Because you, you know, you you fix the streets, you did services. How's the business going? Is it it's coming? It's well. It's tough. It's you know, there's no money, but we're. St we're yeah. Mm. Yeah, because we have a group, a big American group out of Minnesota and Nebraska is going to be opening the first non-oil, non, non, you know, defense and agriculture now in Iraq. And I told them to go to Kirkuk because you're the one who knows business and politics. Yeah, 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 sure, sure. We'll be happy to see them if they come, really. And you should come back also. I will, I will. Yeah. Airbill is a good business center. <laughs> and also Kirkuk is now. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, sir. Okay. I will come over. Thank you, sir. All right.